Well, we're back here at 947. In early March, we introduced you to Valentina and her puppies from Maddie's Heart and Animal Rescue, Heart and Soul Animal Rescue, and we're happy to say that all three dogs have found a new home. It is such good news, and Alexis from Matt's Heart and Soul is back with a very special guest for today's edition of Meet Your New Best Friend, and she has just made herself <laughs> at home here. This is Brandy. She is so cute. Tell us a little bit about her. Yes, this is Brandy. She's about 11 months old. She's a Catahoula Leopard Dog mix. Um, so she's been with us since October, and we're, we're looking to find her home. What is she? What brand? Uh, yeah, say that brand. Again. What? <laughs> a Catahoula Leopard Dog mix. What do, what do we know about those dogs? I don't know that. Um, breed. You know, they're not Hi. super common up in no. Minnesota, more yeah. so in the south, which she came from Texas, so that totally makes sense. Yes. Um, but she's just a great family dog. I mean, she loves kids, other dogs, people. Yeah. And you say that she, okay, so she came to you in October, but she's living with a foster, so she's she's getting interaction and so, being socialized and things like that. Yes, exactly. So there, she's living with two other dogs currently. Okay. Um, she's fully potty trained, crate trained, knows some commands. Likes the cow. Yes, okay. she's very relaxed. Um, but she's just an overall great dog. She's uh, watching the cameras move up and down. It is so like, impressed like, at what, what is happening is here. What's going on here? So you said she's 11 months old. Yes. So is this pretty much her full size? Yeah, this is probably about as big as she'll get, maybe a few pounds. But yeah, she's probably about 50 pounds right now, and it's probably how big she'll be. Okay, so good temperament with other animals. Do yes. we know how she is with kids? She does really well with kids. Okay. Um, her foster brought her to her family's home over the weekend, and she did really well. They had a year and a half year old, and they, oh. they did great. Okay, and you said, I, I heard you say that you guys took her out to a, brew, a brewery as well. Yes, we do events once a month at Venn Brewing in South Minneapolis, yeah. um, and Brandy was there, and she did a really great job. So she sees all the people and doesn't freak out and sees all the other dogs that are there yes. and those kinds of things. So she does she's great. a perfect brewery dog. Hi. She really is. Yeah. She really is. And hey, Brandy, Brandy, can you sit? <laughs> good. Look at that. Sit. This is a good dog. You this guys. is a great dog. Hi, yeah. you're super sweet. Uh, uh, for people that haven't adopted before, uh, walk us through kind of the process with the organization. Yeah, so you'd put in an application on our website, which will be on your website so people can see. Um, and then an adoption coordinator like myself or one of my colleagues will reach out. We'll just talk to you about what you're looking for in your next dog. You know, if you have any cats, other animals, kids, um, we check references and then we do a virtual home visit. It's like yeah. five minutes or so. Um, it's not to check for clutter or anything like that, but we just make sure that the animal won't have any hazards there. Okay. Um, and then you're all approved. So we try to keep it pretty straightforward. So let's say uh, you can't take a big dog like this. You guys recently got, what, 23 dogs? Yes. And we did. Uh, so I'm, I'm assuming they're probably all different sizes. Yes. We have dogs that were, you know, 10 pounds up to 100. 120 pounds so <laughs> and you adopted from Texas why Texas there are a lot of stray dogs there and just yeah. a lot of dogs in shelters so we try to pull as often as we can from Texas hmm. um, not all of our dogs are there or from there but recently a lot have been oh. so how many dogs do you guys have right now looking for homes um, I'd say probably about 40, 40, maybe a little more than 40. And okay. they're all ready to go right now, those 40? Um, so some of them haven't been spayed or neutered yet. Okay. So all of our animals are spayed or neutered prior to adoption and up to date on vaccinations. So okay. rabies, distemper, bordetella, things like that. So you guys are doing good work. Maybe somebody can't take a dog. What can they do to help out? Yeah, just sharing our posts on social media. I yeah. know not a lot of people have heard of us. We're just a smaller rescue. So yeah. sharing our posts. Um, we do have an Amazon wish list for people who okay. are able to donate items. Um, all of our animals are on flea and tick and heartworm preventative. So that's always a big, a big need for us. Um, yeah. Tell us what kind of dog this is one more time in case somebody <laughs> says, I saw this on Minnesota Live. It's a Catahoula Leopard Dog Mix. A Catahoula Leopard <laughs> yes. Dog and you can, Mix. Maybe you can tell on camera, but she's got all these little, she looks like a Dalmatian a little bit. Yes, kind of, that's kind why of. I thought she and might like, be par partial. A minute ago, she rolled over on her belly, and her whole belly on the underside oh. is just full of little dots. Yeah. She's like a little Dalmatian. And she loves freshly polished floors that she are does. cool to lay on. So there you go. I think it's the coolness. Well, Alexis, yeah. thank you so much. Brandy is adorable. She's been quiet. Yeah. She hasn't peed anywhere. No, she no. knows how to sit. She's, she's got it going chill. on. I'm yep. just saying. So she is up for adoption. This is all through Maddie's Heart and Soul Rescue. So we'll post more information for you over at minnesotalive.com.